Hey there, Tam here from Perfect Supplements Australia. Hope you're doing well and you're feeling happy and your mental health is okay during this crazy time in our history with this whole COVID-19 thing. So I get asked often um, by our customers and people that are looking at these amazing supplements, what are our best immune boosting supplements? So today I'm here to answer that and to tell you why. So first up, we've got acai, pronounced acai from the Amazon jungles. This is organic and why acai is good for the immune system is because it, it's very high in antioxidants and also omegas, especially omega-3 is really good for the immune system. So this comes in both a powder and also capsules and I'll leave the links for all these products below the video. Next up we've got the microalgae. So I'm talking about Corella, also comes in capsules and spirulina also comes in capsules and the reason why these ones are so good for the immune system is because they are very high in nutrients and are both known to help with immune function and if you wanted to get them together they also come in a product called aquatic greens so I have written a blog that goes way more into depth about all these products and why with the evidence to support these statements and you can find the blog in the link in the description below this video. So the next one I'm going to talk about briefly is cordyceps. Cordyceps has been used in traditional Chinese medicine for thousands of years because it's known to help with immune function and respiratory function so lung health also with energy so that's a really good one especially at this time. And the next one I'm going to talk about is coconut oil. So coconut oil is a very nutritious food. It's been used for thousands of years by many different nations and it's antiviral. Um, it can give you more energy and so much more. You get all those good healthy fats into your diet. So the next one we're going to talk about today is desiccated liver. So it's a liver supplement basically. It's dried liver put into a capsule. This one also comes in a powder. And why liver is supposedly really good for the immune system is because it contains key immune boosting nutrients like vitamin A, selenium and zinc. So I'll leave the link below this video in the description as well. Next up I'm going to talk about magnesium. Magnesium is actually a very crucial electrolyte and mineral needed for good immune health. So often in life we can become quite low or even depleted in magnesium. So it's really important to keep boosting those magnesium levels. And this is a great way to do it as well as eating organic green vegetables, taking Epsom salt bath regularly and also applying topical magnesium oil to your skin. Next up, I'm going to talk about Machinga. So if you haven't heard of this one, basically it is just organic Japanese matcha powder and organic moringa leaf powder. So matcha powder is very high in antioxidants. As you know, that's really good for your immune system. And moringa is a superfood containing so many key nutrients that help to boost immune health. You can add it to smoothies. You can even make a tea. I'll leave the link to the tea in the description below this video as well. Next up we're going to talk briefly about Rhodiola rosea. So this adaptogenic herb is one incredible herb and it's been around for a long time as well. It was even used by the Vikings to help with energy, stamina and their performance. So this one is meant to be really good for the immune system as well. So you can read about the benefits more in the blog in the link below. And last up we've got Revive which actually contains three of the products that I've mentioned in this video so far. That is acai, cordyceps, rhodiola but it also has grapeseed extract and grapeseed extract is known for, is known to promote health 
immune health by fighting bacterial and viral infections. Sorry, I just had to look at my notes for a second there because that's a lot of things to remember, as you can imagine. So that's pretty much it. We've got quite a few products in the range that have the potential to help boost immunity. So I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Be sure to check out the blog, do your own research, and I'll leave all the links to the products below this video. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.